Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, it's G from Happiness and Crafting. So I have just finished doing a mixed media collage for tomorrow and I thought I would have a go with my watercolours while I've got all my bits and pieces out and make some little um, Easter bunnies and these are like Lisa um, bunny ears with some flowers on and I have made them into some lovely little tags and I've also made like a very very simple Easter card so I just think that's really really lovely um, but I'm just loving the little bunnies now I know how much you liked doing the little um, sort of doodle flowers um, so I thought I would sort of come up with something we could do for Easter and I just love them super simple you will definitely be able to do these now I've just got a little piece of watercolor paper I'm going to come in a little bit closer you so you can see what I'm doing let's go right in there okay so I've just got my um, watercolor palette here um, and my water brush and what I'm going to do look I'm going to show you how you can make a little Easter bunny and it's really really simple so I'm just getting some brown um, watercolor paint so I'm gonna do it I'm gonna actually do it this way because I can fit a couple in there then so I'm gonna do just a big fat round body a head like that and then we just do some ears so that's how simple it is so really easy really easy peasy to do so that's a little bunny you can take some of the um, paint off and then go back in and just go around the edge just one one side so it's almost like a little bit darker on one side just like that and then take a little look how grubby my piece of paper is just take a little blob and take his little tail out can you see just so he's got a little bit of a white fluffy tail so that is our little bunny how simple should we do another one let's go a little bit more so we've got little round body little round head well you can make them as big and as fat as you like a bit more and then we've got the little ears just like that so really really simple so obviously you can have the ears going up but I've just I think they look really cute sort of bent don't they okay let's just take a little bit of that out for his tail let's go in there just a little bit darker around that side there we go look at that little Easter bunnies okay now we're going to make some ears so this is really really simple as well so we take the brown again and I'm going to just do that just like that little Easter bunny ears okay so that's our ears and then I'm going to just take that off and then we want some little flowers on here so the same as what we did with the sort of doodly watercolour flowers and all I'm going to do is just like this just round to the side doesn't matter how you do it and then I'm going to pop so we just pop a little bit of orange in the middle like that now we need to let that dry so let's do some more ears so just like that so these ones I've joined up and these ones you don't have to join them up you can just go round like that a little bit dark around the outside you can go like this doesn't matter how you do it you've just got some little bunny ears so we just go around this one a little bit just like that look okay and then should we have some orange flowers on this one and then we're just going to put the orange blobs like that you don't even have to do the little blobs like we did on the bigger flowers these are just sort of almost like um, scruffy circles okay now let's see 
I think they are. I'm just going to quickly dry it off with my heat gun, make sure they're really dry. There we go, perfect. So we're going to just draw over the top of this. Now I've got the 0.3 pi um, pigment line in, it's a water um, resistant one. So but do make sure this is all dry. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to start with this little ear. Can you see? Let me have a look. Yes, I think so. Just go up like that. Just do like a little scruffy ear. Go around a couple of times, across there. Little round head. And then just, it's almost like sketching around it. And then his little tail, sort of do like a little C. So it's not quite... And then a couple of little dots there so you, it's not a really round round one and there we go that's your little bunny so should we do that one again so just do the ears like that and like that and i just think these make lovely little tags or cards just a little sketch around like that and his little bunny tail a couple of little dots like that you could pop a little bit of little pom-pom or something on there as well, couldn't you? So there we go. There's your little bunnies. Now, for the... Oh, we didn't. Do you know what I forgot? I forgot to do the leaves on this one. The little green leaves. Let's get rid of some of that pink. Okay. Let's do the leaves. We need some leaves on the heart. Plant. So look at this. Just pop a couple of little leaves around there just like that again on this one not really leaves they're just sort of little dotty things that you can make there's little shapes like that okay now i need to quickly dry those again so you can see how simple it is and what i'm going to do i'm just going to go up there like that, just do a little sketch like that. And then on our flowers, you've got the little middle bit like that, and then just do five petals, go around a couple of times like that. Oops. Okay, you can do a little. Because they're small, you don't need to do too much in there. And then we've got our little leaves. Like that. And this one, really simple. There we go. And then we will do this one. So again, just sort of sketch his little ear. Just go around. Doesn't matter, you don't have to do it perfect because I think this is the nice thing it's because it's doodly doesn't have to be perfect now again you can do any colours that you want in any of these can't you whatever you want to um, put it with There we go, look at that, how simple is that? Now I'm going to just cut these out really quickly. So we've got our little fat bunnies. Look at them, aren't they just the cutest? Cut them around. Now you can pop these on key, on, on key rings, on paper clips. You can make them and you're just going to laminate them. You can put them on tags in your journals. You could make bigger ones, actually make them as a tag, couldn't you, to hang off if you give anybody Easter eggs or a little Easter gift. You could pop a little hole in the ear if you made it bigger and just hang it from a gift bag. So there's lots of ways and I just think they are the cutest. And simple, quick and simple. And if you probably had a little doodle flower as well biggest doodle flower they would be nice hanging off together wouldn't they so just quickly cut that out look at that 
cutie cutie and then let's do our ears now with the ears as well you could pop a little bow on couldn't you wouldn't that look cute have a little bow on there a little bit of bling a little bit of stickles on the flowers I think they are lovely I'm going to show you how to make a very quick tag. Like this is just fussy cut it out really, really quickly. Like that. Look at that, perfect. Okay, I'll pop those to the side. And I'm going to show you. Look, I've got a little tag ready. I just cut these out, look, I think it's just lovely. This one I've popped on a little bit of foam tape, so he just sticks up just a little bit. So make sure I'm in view. Did you see that one? There we go. I'm going to come out just a little bit. That's better. Just so you can see what I'm doing. Now I'm going to write Happy Easter on here. So you can do it however you like but I think sort of like a little scruffy handwriting looks really nice so I'm going to take my pen again and I'm going to just do just like a little bit of grass on here like that okay that's just so we can have the little bunny sitting on some grass I'm going to just dab a little bit of that off like that and then I'm going to take a little bit of pink and I'm going to pop a few little pink dots just dots, you don't have to do flowers they're just little, little dots like that let me just quickly dry that there we go and then our little bunny just sits on there so it looks like he's sitting on the grass he's a little bit big really um, but that's okay He's a nice big fat bunny, isn't he? So I'm just going to do that. Fold that over. Pop that on the back of here. So that's a double thickness of foam tape. And then all we do is we just pop that on there like that. I do have a little bit of ribbon here. So we can pop this through here and then we have a lovely little tag pop that through isn't that the cutest just chop it off and then you've got this fab little tag which is just a little happy easter tag now another thing you can do is take a little card like this it's just one of these simple cards now you can put three little bunnies along here like that so you can have a little three bunnies you can do the bunnies this one's got his ear up like that so you can do them however you like and again you can pop a little bit of green along there um, like a little bit of grass I do have this which says happy Easter now these are off these which are my um, words and phrases in the pastels which are absolutely gorgeous so we've got the happy so i think that looks really nice doesn't it should we just do that on there and i quite like it is it plain so if you've got um friends or anything that um just like the basics and they're not really into all our journaling stuff and fancy stuff these are absolutely perfect aren't they and again, you can have a little pair of ears in the middle, which would look nice. Actually, I like the three little bunnies. I'm going to just put this around here. I should have put the ears on a tag, shouldn't I, really? But that's okay. Right, I'm going to put this on first so I know I'm in line. And then I'm going to do some grass again. I think that looks really nice. So a little happy Easter on there 
and then I'm going to, shall we put tape on them? Let's pop a little bit of tape on them. The big fat bunny there. Two other bunnies, look. So a little one there. And then let's just get some watercolour paint again. Oops, I've got red on there. Don't want that, do we? And again, just do a little bit of... This is a perfect colour to go with a little Easter tag, isn't it? Take a little bit of this off. These are really simple, aren't they? I'm going to quickly dry that. There we go. Don't put too much on. This isn't watercolour paper. This is just a card. So um, if you've just got sort of cards, be careful it doesn't sort of warp it too much. So let's just put couple of little flowers on here, look, a couple of little dots around like that, perfect, isn't that lovely? So shall we have, what should we do, we put this one, this one and this one, shall we put this one in the middle, if I can take the tape off, there we go you sit there in the middle big fat one that can go there and then we got this little one on the end look at that isn't that just the cutest so some fab simple little cards simple little tags loving the little ears so these are some just little doodles these are just ideas that i've given you just to pop them on tags and cards um but quick and easy so if you've got a little gift you want to send out for easter you can pop these on there as well so super super simple to do so there we go guys i thought i'd just quickly show you um, because I think they are really, really lovely. And it's another one you can make to pop into your stash as well. So there we go, guys. Thank you so, so much for joining me. Have a fantastic rest of the evening and I will see you soon. All right, guys. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.